In lecture, I am going to discuss what how to perform auto increment in Oracle SQL Developer. So there, first I am going to create new tables. So now you can see here I am using the Oracle SQL Developer. So to create the tables, right click on the tables, then after new table. And uh, first here we need to give the name of the table. So giving the name cost. And after that here the first uh, that's for id and uh, this would be number and here this is specifying primary key the next is let's add giving the second column name name and this should be back here and uh, that's all fine then after here the next is address and this is here where and 20 size and the next is here pin so this here we need to give and pin should not be null so after giving this all information you need to click on this ok so now here you can see uh, there is a table that created after that the next is let's go and click on this edit and uh, the next is uh, uh, since this uh, come there okay so after that when I open now you can see this all those things and here you can see identity columns identity columns so now or uh, the next is here you need to click on uh, first go to identity column then column sequence so trigger name that comes cause trigger thereafter sequence schema is or you can see a card that's come there and this here sequence that come cost seconds so after that click on this ok so when I click on ok then or uh, here if I go on this trigger so trigger is there so you can see cost trigger that created and uh, if I go on this sequence so cost seconds that created now the next is here so if i perform this query select a star from so select a star from cost then oh, let's execute this query so initially the table does does not have any records so i'm going to insert the records so for this one we need to use the query insert into so insert into which one so there you can see cost option that comes and uh, here you need to or uh, give the columns name so first here you can see id name address and thereafter pin and there we need to give the values so id is now let's give here one zero or then or the name is in single code you need to give the name let's give here smith and after that address let's give here birth and pin 9090 so after this, after giving the correct information, let's execute this query. So now you can see one row inserted. So if I execute this query, then you can see this is the table contents. So what is the benefit of auto increment? So in the auto increment, so I applied the auto increment, auto increment that applied on the primary key. So here you don't need to specify uh, this place ID okay and you don't need to give ID values. So each time when the query executed then that generated the ID form and like that every time or uh, you can increase by one. So when you insert new value then the ID increase by one. So this here you can see Smith 
so let's so change here open 9090 now if i execute this query so you can see there is no any problem window inserted and uh, since this place i did not to uh, specify the id columns and no values also but uh, when i execute this query then uh, one row inserted and uh, this the value that come here you can see or uh, one that comes so this time you can run the query without specifying id so this increase by one so this times let's give you the name of the employees or customer so let's give you sam and uh, city and derby and uh, here let's give uh, unique pin 9092 so uh, here if i execute this query so now one row inserted and when i perform this so you can see next time that come to okay so like that or uh, this is the benefit of auto increment so you don't need to uh, give the address values and this time you if you are trying to perform the insert query so according to that here one to next that come three okay so but here you can also specify when i give your id so definitely this place four columns are there so you need to give here or uh, four so let's give this one five okay now if i execute this query so one row inserted now here this is a uh, five and if i don't specify so this place uh, here let's give uh, uh, this time check and uh, city name London mm -mm. now let's give the pin 9093 after that the real question is what exactly the auto increment id will id value that come either 3 or 6 5 is there so it may be 6 or it may be 3 so let's execute that so one row inserted now here you can see so it's taken the 3 so here auto increment to or that's uh, or when you is when you perform insert query then that to uh, the values that start from 1 and is time then that increases by one so first here one then next then this is the auto increment that i perform so three then next is four after that five is already there so next time that comes here six okay so this is how auto increment uh, we can perform in oracle sql developer so without to uh, or uh, doing any hard query you can do some or uh, manual steps to perform the auto increment so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you